It's the second time in less than seven months police have been called to a local factory for an employee with a gun. News 4's Dave Graber is in Dunkirk with more on what happened at one of the city's largest employers and what the company is doing to prevent it in the future. For the second time in less than seven months, an employee here at Fieldbrook Foods in Dunkirk has been arrested on gun charges. And police say quick action by the company and cooperation with authorities helped to thwart a potentially dangerous situation. An employee here at Fieldbrook Foods should be commended for his role in the arrest of two men on gun charges, says Dunkirk Police Chief David Ortolano. Police were called to the ice cream factory shortly before 545 yesterday evening after that employee spotted what he thought was a gun handoff right on the production line. Within minutes, uh, the, the two suspects uh, uh, in an office space area, and at that point in time, our officers did uh, pat them down and find a loaded handgun on them. Record state Christian Marin Sanchez passed a loaded 9 millimeter to Hector Carmona Burgos. I'm sure that the uh, manufacturing company has maybe some type of a employee policy about bringing weapons onto the premises as well. But, uh, you know, not a good situation to, to be into if you're going to work. I wouldn't see any reason why you would need to bring something like that to work with you. It's the second time in less than seven months an employee has faced gun charges for an incident that happened at the plant. In September, 41-year-old Rolando Rivera Santos, a convicted felon, was charged with threatening co-workers with a gun that he brought with him to work. Dunkirk Mayor Wilford Rosas says Fieldbrook, one of the city's largest employers, is doing what it can to protect its workers. But I do know and am aware that the company has upgraded their security system uh, with their security cameras inside over the past year. So I know that they are uh, taking uh, action to prevent incidents like this from continuing to happen. As of this report, the two men arrested here on Monday remain in city lockup pending their arraignment. Meanwhile, police say a check of the gun reveals that it was not stolen, but their investigation is continuing. Reporting from Dunkirk, Dave Graber, News 4 at 5.